Hello. Okay. So the people who are here, what keeps happening is YouTube keeps dropping the chat saying, I have violated the terms of service. I have no idea why. The first time I was playing music, fair enough. Second time I was watching a stream of uh, a panel. Third time, no idea. Fourth time, no idea. I think this is the fifth time. Holy, I don't think it's just tonight. Like, I think it's like, and, and Crowdcast, no, oh, fudge. We figured that might be the reason I got canceled. Is the other service, they cost money. I don't want to use them. I am wearing pants. I do have pants. Um, yeah, it's like when it comes up, it, you can't even click on what causes it. So I'm going to do some research. Um, so I don't know if like what the alternative is. I mean, there are options. There's like a streaming option and then a webcam option. I'm using the webcam option because the streaming option does not work. Uh, but as anybody when on other Patreons that you've, and if this goes down, just refresh the link. I mean, I'll give it a shot for another like 15 minutes because I'm determined. Um, on other Patreons, is this how they do it, or do they do it a different way? Do they use the other way, or what? I will wait for your messages. Maybe I'll do Google. So I guess what he does is he does it on his own and then. It's not streaming. I mean, isn't a stream. All I want to do is be able to read, read you guys talking to me and not have to type it out. Oh, limited 10 people? Hmm. How would I make that fair, do you think? Um, yeah, I mean, most people have Twitch, but. Um, that's really complicated for me to do. Plus, if I'm playing a game, I'm not going to pay attention. Like, I mean, I thought it'd be cool. I can work on masks and while well, I'm pinning, I can talk to you guys. Like, not right now, but if this works out in the future. Then I'll broadcast. Hmm. I mean, okay, I'll look, I'll look that up. Because I, I do want to do more streaming. Because <clears throat> I hate typing. So, thank you, um, everybody who's here at super late at night. Oh, YouTube exclusively. Well, then why am I getting, like, dinged? I mean, I'm covered up. I have nothing questionable in the background. That's crazy. Maybe I should look at Twitch. Can you have private... Twitch chats? I mean, is this something that would be on Twitch if I'm not playing games? Because if I was playing games, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm playing Final Fantasy Zone, I'm probably going to ignore the screen. <laughs> yeah. And I heard, like, people can come in your Twitch chat and be real a-holes. And I want to do something for Patreon people. Um... You know, I guess I could privately send you guys all the links, but then I'm like spam messaging 200 people and I give a crap. Oh yeah, they do like a slice of life. I've seen some people. Hmm. Okay, so let me write that down. Google Hangouts. Twitch. Sorry guys, it's not as exciting as I thought. This is why the fuck does YouTube keep kicking me off. Uh, Google Hangouts. I guess I'll look up Twitch. Um... Well, let me show you the real reason I'm sure you're here. It's 
this little guy. He's sleeping. Uh, I think so. <laughs> not worth it. I think someone used a phone or process. Um Yeah, the problem was like if I'm making a costume I'm like over there. And then I have like my sewing machine beside me. And I mean right now I'm kinda like set up. I've got literally the small cage right here. You can see my, my sewing table right there. Uh, that's my three D that's my three D printer. Um and then like all the way across the room um is my laser cutter. So I did want to point out that um and I'll probably be saying this a lot, it's really thanks to you guys and pledging. Um I wish I could move stuff. Okay. You can't really see it. Okay, see a little oh crap. <laughs> Keep pointing away. See that little gray piece? That's my leg. That's my thigh. And then it's slowly gonna make a giant leg. So thank you. About like a gazillion rolls of filament, thanks to your guys' pledges. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love an excuse to play video games, but So I think what oops if you made. Okay, let me see. Um but yeah, that's my surger. That's a shit ton of masks I'm making. Well here, you guys might appreciate this. These are my Edward scissor hands. <clears throat> Look at those. My hand. I 3D printed the hand too. Um, so, I won't be able to sign prints wearing this, um, and I'll be able to social distance myself at least 12 inches, but yeah. So, this, um, the other hands are done, they're just over on the other side. <laughs> Oh, so bad. So I wear so many pajama bottoms now that um, this every day I'm wearing pajamas or sweatpants that I have actually thread worn a pair of my pajama pants. And for almost half a day, I realized I'd blown the ass out. So it's just a big gaping hole in my butt crack that you can totally see. So, good thing I didn't go out and uh, run any errands in my blown up gym pants. I was just like, I was like reaching down here. I'm like, what is going, going on? So, that was. Blew out an asshole. Um, but yeah, you guys can ask any questions. Um, I'll look into those two things because that might be good <clears throat> if you want to hang out. We can, I think you can actually play music too on those other two um, platforms, which would be nice because I'm sitting in silence right now. Um, oh, I'm going to just show you stuff on my desk because that's what you want to see. These are my Tamaki gloves. You know, it's just something about blowing out my crotches. Anyone who knows those stories? Right, so, this is my, so yeah, this is my Fire Force character. Shifted. Oh, yeah, that's that. Weird. Now that I'm looking at it, I think it should be over. Um, I have. Oh, I like this. This is my. Um, I'll let it come into focus. Wait, 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 wait. So, this is my um, cell phone stand. It's a butt. Right, there you go. It's a butt. She's got lingerie on, but it's a butt. My desk is. I don't know how to use Discord. 
choose who the links and it's not public. Um, yeah, but again, it's like tough because it's like I want to do something for Patreon people because you know you guys are pledging. Um, I, I mean, all those are great options, but I can't like sort of make it exclusive to you guys. I feel kind of bad. So anyways, yeah, it's, why is this not coming up? I am some kind of streaming noob. Uh, what else do I have? I don't really have anything. Yeah, I guess I can make a Patreon post. And then in the Patreon post, just give you guys a link. And be like, hey, it's good for. Because I think with Discord, I let somebody in, but then I have to kick them out. Oh, stop fighting. Um, yeah. Well, we've made it 12 minutes. I haven't been kicked out. Um, yeah. So, if you guys have any questions, I know it's very impromptu. I feel like I got kicked off again. No one's saying anything. Um, yeah, these are all the masks I'm making. Ooh, ooh. So, probably have like 250 masks. I've done a bunch of batches and given some for free. The 3D printer amazing. I am using the, it's called the Raise 3D. It actually goes from here all the way to there, which is why it's a bedside 12 by 24 ish. Um, if you do want to buy that or you want to buy a blowforge, tell me. I think I have like a reference code or referral code. Um, the new Raise is super nice. Um, this one's kind of a few years old few years old. Um, I was actually uh, looking at some of the new options they have and I'm curious if I can like update my current one because there's like I have like a dual extruder but it's not the greatest and I guess the new one like lifts up and because I want to print in rubber. Um, I also do not know how to model so it's something I'm wanting to teach myself. Oh my god. Uh, but yeah. It's got a camera. The new one has a camera and it has like a filament detector when you're going to run out. Mine doesn't have any of that. So I'm like constantly watching to make sure the filament doesn't run out. I mean, that leg, the, it, it's like, it's like, this, 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 my ankle. My thigh and my ankle. Um, so, Bye, Stan. Oh, the, um, okay, that first question is, oh, the glove is for Tamaki. Uh, she's a character from Fire Force. Can I, oh, I'm worried if I show you the picture, it'll not come off the internet. Um, so she's like a firefighter character. It's like a cute, a cute design. And then, what was it like for you? It's definitely weird. I just always feel like I need to be working. And honestly, uh, I'm sort of busier now than I was on set. I wake up. I've had the squirrels for like two and a half weeks. Um, they need to be fed every four hours right now. Just this week, I can actually sleep through the night and skip one feeding so I can get like eight hours sleep before I was only getting four hours sleep. Um, uh, but they're set, and then there's like, if they're, they haven't been feeling well, and then, uh, not to get too much into it, they're having potty problems, so even then, I was feeding them that two hours, giving them fluid, yada, yada, yada. and then with mask making, and, um, like I said, or, um, sorry, 
that's the problem with like looking at myself in a live stream. Um, yeah, just somehow I'm like filling the days even though I run zero errands. How did you? How did you arrange to get your? How did you arrange to get your three? Uh, the three D scan came from a company, local company, that did it for me as a favor because I recommended them for a uh, job. Uh, unfortunately, the company is no longer in business, and there were some, I think, s some issues with the scan, uh, like the feet. I was wearing like wedge shoes and I think they just kind of simplified everything but um and uh, a friend of mine Danquish was able to like cut the scan into manageable pieces for my 3d printer but I know there's like iPad software you can use to scan um so I mean I have like a ton of molds but um it is nice to have a scan of yourself. So, um, I will do, we'll do another three minutes and then I'm going to go to bed. It is almost, it's 1230 here. I've been up since six, which, I mean, that's like a normal movie day for me, but, um, I don't know. It is. It's. I think the toughest thing is just not knowing when we're starting again. Um, you know, just trying to. I want to come out of the quarantine with costumes, with new skills. And I don't want to feel like I've wasted the time. But it doesn't matter how much I do. I'm still going to have that feeling. Hey, Glenn. Welcome. So that's probably the difficult thing for me is just. No matter how much I weigh down my schedule, uh, I feel like I can be doing more. Like, I really was going to try to teach myself 3D. And um, I kind of took a stab at it in late March. And I just sucked at it. It just does not come naturally to me. And then I also have a laser cutter I bought a few years ago, Coolforge, and then Kickstarter. And so, um, I'm trying to teach myself how to use that. How many costumes are currently in progress? Um, yeah, Yuffie. Uh, so what I have finished is Christmas Sailor Moon, Tamaki, Sheila from Dungeons and Dragons. In the works is Edward Scissorhands, Yuffie. I know there's another. Oh, Nina from Breath of Fire. That's a, I just love Breath of Fire. Um, yeah, there's kind of that. Like, I'm just kind of finishing up stuff that I started. And I just haven't, like, got, oh, and Daphne from Dragon's Lair. That's more of a photo shoot costume. And then, like, three days later, they announced the live action. Yeah, you know, I'm, like, really going out my way to not add anything, but I'm definitely having getting distracted by new series. Just keep thinking about getting a 3D printer and there's always something else I need money for. Yeah, I mean, honestly, for a long time I was like, I'm not getting a 3D printer until I learn how to model. And then um, I saw this one that came out a few years ago and I was like, this will force me to model. And I have it. Ugh, yes, there was a breath of fire on the mobile phone. I was so excited for it, and then they never released it outside of Japan. I was like, damn it! But it's uh, Nina from 2 when she has the small wings. Aw, thank you guys so much for being here. Like I said, it's first time seeing how long it lasts, seeing what the quality's like, looking at other options. I'm kind of quiet. This is the most talking I've done in probably a month.
Um, so what are you guys doing this weekend? Or I guess tomorrow. Oh yeah, it's a, I've seen people say Perusa, Persia. I mean, I I really I do like the rays. It's got a really big, tall print bed. Um, it's got an LCD screen. Uh, especially the new one. The new one's got like all the bells and whistles. Oh, give yourself a haircut. Oh, good God. I have not. Look how long the hair is. Take it down. See how bad it looks. Oh, I washed it. And then I put it up so it's going to be big. That's not even. Yeah, that's pretty long for me. Mother's Day tomorrow. Oh, I'm gonna call my mom. But yeah, well, I'm just thinking about cutting my bangs. That's probably if I go another month, I'll probably cut my bangs. Painting house, cleaning house. <laughs> well, hopefully, Mother's Day, I'm gonna try to do a pickup at a farmer's market, uh, and then I'm gonna probably work on masks in between taking care of the squirrels. Um. What's better? What's better for cosplay to have short or long hair, wigs versus styling? I'd never use my real hair. I hate it. Uh, it doesn't hold a style. So eight hours outside, it's just not gonna look good. Um, for wearing a wig, uh, I like short. I don't know. Both have advantages. Like you can kind of like faux. If you put your hair up and you put it there, you can kind of create like a faux bump. In a wig, which can be really attractive, um, but generally I prefer maybe a little this shorter, shorter hair, yeah. and uh, um, I think the only time, one of the few times I use my real hair is Princess Leia because I I pull my hair up and then I use my real hair in the bun. Which is a total pain in the ass. Um, and then one time it was so short, I had to buy a wig, and that was even more of a pain in the ass. So it was like hair, lock the wig to my head, and then put all this big hairy mass on either side of my head. So, um, but yeah, anyways, I'm gonna call it a night. I'm gonna take a shower, wash my face. And, um, anyways, I really appreciate you guys coming out. Uh, remember, if you've not sent me your address for postcards, just send me a message. And then, um, I gotta, oh, I gotta go through the entries. Let's see, you guys pulled up some costumes that even I don't remember doing. So, um, that was great. So I gotta go through and see which three people have the most. And then I'll also do some research on, um, the other things we talked about that's not for streaming so thank you guys i'll see you later i'm gonna try to make this a regular thing somehow it's a huge thank you for pledging um again because of you it's like you can see my edward scissor hand hands there um you can see oh there's my yuffie headpiece that i'm working on um behind her is uh, actual toe hooks i'm printing for a local hospital um and then, again, because of your donation, I'm able to buy filament and tools and materials to keep making cosplay. So um, it definitely, like, it really helps out. So I totally appreciate it. Um, and uh, I'll probably be saving for a new computer because that would definitely make Twitch easier. But, um, but, yeah, I'm really thankful for you guys. I really appreciate it, you know. There's a lot of other places you could pledge that do more than just post what I post. So the fact you guys are here really means a lot. Yeah, and like I said, we'll do this again. It was just, <laughs> YouTube is just being a nightmare. And I'm sure it'll cut me out right there. This won't be talking shit about it. Um, so everybody get some rest. Stay safe. Um, wear your masks. 
Don't go too crazy giving yourself haircuts. And uh, yeah, I'll look into Twitch or, or Google Hangout. Um, and it might be a case where I just make a Patreon post uh, that only you guys can access with links to those. So, oh yeah, everybody rolls in. But yeah, I have sleepy squirrels. I have to take to bed. Uh, and I have to get up in the morning to go to the farmer's market. So, bye guys. Thank you.